Alright, we're back with Donkey Kong Country 2, Diddy's Conquest. We're playing Bramble Scramble. Let's go. Oh. I kinda wanna start off with uh, Diddy. So we can hold uh, her in reserve. Whoa. And I was wise to, because I, I didn't think they'd uh, do that so quickly. I mean, it's not a matter of speed, it's a matter of timing. Hey, <laughs> huh? I mean, I, I thought that they would they would turn down. They, they would uh, go up more, or down more, whatever direction they were. Because you can't go back arbitrarily. I want to harvest those purple plants and make some fortify conjuring potions. It's alteration or something. Maybe both. I think it does like two of them. The lavender. Now we're free. And there's another right here. I guess we did get a, a token out of it. Probably nothing worth investigating. Uh, I guess that's good enough. I was trying to do is to hold up and see if that kept her fall from going descending too quickly. No, we only have an O. But it, well, it didn't really help. I said them to give us two. No birds. That was nice. What well, we were supposed to know that was gonna happen because the bananas were there. Like, oh yeah, those are there. It's not just for, you know, little salons to get the bananas. Because it's not like we've ever seen anything like that. Oh, cut that out, you fucking monkey. I'll press up or down if I want you to go on the up or down vine. I like uh, Diddy's uh, horizontal climb animation. His arms swing out a lot more. No spiders, huh? Since when were spiders a part of anything around here? bird, though. Hmm. 
It's not like they put those bananas there to warn us that we needed to go over there. Otherwise, a tidal wave of death was going to hit us from the top of the screen and to the right. to see how bloodthirsty you are. There's no real tactical reason to kill that. Well, you could imagine that you could... Okay, there's nothing over there. What's that uh-uh-uh-uh sound? Who's doing that? Anyway, it's a staple to put a secret somewhere in, like, an enemy circle. Yeah, look at him swing his arms. I wonder if he goes faster on the vines, like I was used to Dixie's uh, speed. So when that didn't manifest, you know, it was faster than I was expected. Expecting. faster than I was expecting, so, uh, you know, I ran into the projectile. Fuck off. On. Nice on. expecting you to not know that you can hold down to uh, moderate your flight. Because if they aren't expecting it, some of those are pretty mean. Some of the what's it, what do you call it? Precision. Some precision flying. allowed. Because banana, coin. Banana, monkey. Banana, coin. Banana, monkey. Whoops, I don't want to go back in here. Can I exit? I just want to exit. Oh, okay. Pause and select does the trick. Nice, Serino. I think that that's... Can you do that? Okay, you can't do that on a stage you haven't beaten. I figured as much. I'm gonna explore. Hmm. Interesting. Any more? Probably doesn't look like there's any more up there. Switch, will you? Destroy them all. Corrupt the child. Destroy them all. Uh, wasn't that just get to the end or something? Hmm, whatever. Now, what's really confusing me is why there was a minecart. Wait, 
Is it a stage that goes to the... Oh, that can't be right. Oh, it's a race. That's why. Or it's something. Oh. Thanks for telling me too early. You stupid explanation mark sign. I guess it's not like a... It's a warning to let you know that it's gonna happen, but... It's not like re too reactionary or anything. It's not even like a, a deadly jump. You could be in some serious trouble if you jump on one of them and then you die. Because you land bad. I kind of wish the sign wasn't there, actually. The bananas are kind of enough warning, I think. Oh well. Cock. Well, cocker. Oh, interesting. It's kind of stressing me out knowing that you have have enemies to kill along the track. Uh, and, you, you know, there are, like, ways to die easily. Uh, I probably shouldn't have picked that scab. I'm gonna bleed all across my leg now. Alright, do you got anything that's free? I didn't think so. Yeah, we did so well. Oh. I guess it's like a golf course or something? <laughs> Kinda. Whoa. Guess they expect you to do die to him on your first encounter. We got another box. Prize is another box. Well, that time it was bananas. What I really want to know if, is if you can jump on them. while they're spinning. Hmm. That's basically the same thing, isn't it? Oh, that was a DK barrel. I didn't see no DK on it, though. You know, I used to edit things like that out, where it was just like an attempt that went by in like a flash. But I think maybe you don't do that, because then the life counter isn't, uh, consistent. And that matters, because, uh, well, since it's actually possible for me to game over, you know, it would mean something to keep track of. I mean, it matters, too. Okay, so that's an annoying thing. Does she just not stop spinning? What? Why did I die before? Now how the hell does that work? If 
fuck. What happens if I just stick here? Why? It's not going in the same direction as him. Jump on him while he's spinning. Let's hope that one. Okay, good. Guess I do have one more life left to live. Wouldn't be so annoying if they didn't change the the hitbox from compared to Donkey Kong Country One, because I guarantee you that would have been perfectly fine in that game. What's this? Okay. Good luck, children. Oh, okay. What? Oh, I see. It's bananas if you don't if you have all party members. So that's actually a trap. Hmm, whatever. You know, I do believe they're making fun of Sonic the Hedgehog. 
could be mistaken. But I don't think so. Wow, cool. Fudge. So, yeah, the, 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 these are the ones you pay the, the keeper of the gate. Hmm, I don't care. Wait. Okay, I guess that did it. Jesus. Ah, I see. Timing's a little different for where they place the bananas and where I jump from, but I guess that's fine. Fuck you. I don't need you to get the Z. I don't need to get the Z at all, see? Oh, fudge. where that's coming from. Ooh, fun. Let me guess. Well, I guess it would have been cool to get the other kind of token, but that's what will do. <coughs> yeah, this guy. Alright, let's see. Here's the Crumlin's Lost World. That big old crocodile head in the middle is where you need to get to if you're going to finish this silly game properly. Mm, I don't know if we're going to do that, but to get there you have to beat Captain K. Rule and clip all the bonus levels as well. A task I'm sure is well beyond a whippersnapper like you. I don't know why I'm doing this, but here are some ridiculously cheap hints for this world, which I'm sure you'll need be needing as well. What do you want this time? It's just gonna be one coin each. Oh. Okay, so you, you pay him to get to one of these levels. I think the other one was over there or something. I don't... I guess we might do that, I don't know. Uh, next up is Ramby Rumble, so we'll do that in the next one. So, see you then. Bye.